How's everybody doing tonight? Delicious. Uh, if you guys heard rumbling earlier, that was my voice. Uh, it's the only part of my body strong enough to carry. Uh, as you can tell by the lack of life in my eyes, I'm straight. Uh, I feel like the, the gay community is a really lively community, and that's what I love about it. Like, gay people have parades. Straight people don't have parades. The closest thing as a straight man I have to a parade is a sale at Ace, the hardware place. Uh, I have a lot of gay friends. Uh, we're all, we go to the same community college and we're all pretty much unemployed, but they've got tailored suits. I don't get where they get the money. Every time I see a gay man, they're usually dressed like fresh AF, very nice. I don't know what it is about being gay, but it's very financially stable. It is very, I think the new gay trend is a PhD in microeconomics and no one is letting us know. Another thing I like about them is that anytime there's like a spicy rumor, they always know first. Anytime a pot of tea is brewed, they always have a cup before everyone else. By the time a dumb straight guy like me, by the time like a, like a straight like me just gets like the spicy rumor, there's already a note there that says like, heard about this three months ago, XOXO, gossip gay. Like, what's up, bitch? Like, uh, <laughs> I'm not, like, aggressively straight. I've seen another, like, man's genitals, like, in the wild, you know? <laughs> like, at a urinal. It just, just to know, just to know, like, I've seen Animal Planet. It's okay to look. It looked a lot like a uh, woolly willy, but someone forgot to erase it. I, uh, it looked in a bad shape. Like, it wasn't a good one. I haven't seen a lot, but if that's my benchmark, I'm definitely straight. Like, I was, I was worried Sarah McLaughlin would come out of nowhere, like, in the arms of, for 25 cents a day, you can save this poor thing from being beaten senselessly, constantly, twice on Valentine's Day. <laughs> Just made a Sarah McLaughlin joke about some guy's penis. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna leave on this. I feel like uh, the phrase no homo was really dumb. I hugged my friend the other day. I've known him for three years, and he hugged me and he said, hey, no homo. And I just wanna say right now on record, if the only thing keeping you from being gay is saying no homo, you're gay, dude. I don't know what to tell you. Thank you very much. I'm Amir Shiromi.